YouTube, the world's largest online video site, still isn't sure what its relationship is with TV. For proof, look no further than the advertising event they held here in New York City last night. Last year, when YouTube held a big advertiser event just like it, they went Hollywood. They promoted all of the original channels that they had funded, about 100 in total, many with big stars attached. The company told advertisers they could buy packages of ads around these safe spaces, these channels that they and their partners had created. But some of the channels didn't work out, and they were barely mentioned at the advertiser event last night in New York. This time around, the message from YouTube was all about its homegrown hits. They brought out YouTube stars that had amassed a following for themselves via the site. And YouTube recommended that advertisers get involved and create their own content, sometimes bypassing the content that others have created. The Google chairman, Eric Schmidt, came out on stage and talked about how YouTube is different from TV, how it's more participatory than TV. He said at one point, quote, this is a new thing we have to figure out. The emphasis was all about how YouTube is not TV. Hi, Mr. President. It's great to hang out with you today. I'm looking forward to it. The truth is, it's all of the above. For some people, young people in particular, YouTube is replacing TV. Look at the deal that was struck this week between DreamWorks Animation and a YouTube channel called Awesomeness TV one of the most popular channels for teens. DreamWorks bought Awesomeness in part to teach it how to be better online, how to reach young people on the web. But for many other people, YouTube just supplements TV. It's another option for original programming, or it's an alternative to the tube. Already, as YouTube pointed out at its event for advertisers, it is by some measures already more popular among 18 to 34 year olds than any TV channel out there. This time next year, YouTube will probably have even more impressive stats to share but it'll probably still be trying to figure out its relationship to television.